Hi guys. So I've got Delaney here, and I've got my little babies over here. I'm going to change Delaney today. I actually did a changing video with her to put her into this outfit that she's got on. But um, my boys wrecked it. <laughs> they were absolutely just crazy. So I could not, I could not post that on YouTube. It was, it was obnoxious. So I'm going to change her into, let me get this for you. This little outfit. <coughs> Whoa. <coughs> Excuse me. My goodness. This cute little cloud outfit. It's short sleeve. Footless. And it's kind of a little roughly down there. Gathered. Whatever you call it. So I'm going to take care of Delaney. Um, I am expecting an order from Bountiful Baby to come in today. It's glass beads and some more cable ties. Um, and I'm going to work on reweighting um, Rook. Uh, just because I like my babies heavy, and she's really not heavy. And um, she's got these weird, like, silicone or rubber um, pellets in her legs. She had them in her arms, too. I took them out of her arms and put glass beads in her arms, but I ran out of glass beads. So um, her arms need more glass beads, and her legs need more glass beads, and I'm going to possibly put some more in her body as well. <clears throat> I've also been thinking about, when I got her, she had a magnet in her head for um, bows, and she had one for pacifiers, but... When I took her stuffing out to um, to reweight her head, um, because her head didn't have barely any weight in it, when I took the stuffing out, the magnets came right out. So I was like, oh, okay, well, these weren't in here very well then. And um, <clears throat> I think I want to put one in for a magnet. <laughs> put one in for a magnet. I want to put one in for a um, bow, because I don't like to just keep putting headbands on her, even though she looks absolutely adorable in headbands. I love them on her. Um, I want I wanted to be able just to stick a bow on her head as well. So I'm going to be doing that hopefully later today. Um, so yeah, I might be able to make a video. My husband is home today. Um, and, you know, obviously Eli is going to be home. They're not home right now, um, but they'll be home later. And my boys are at school, so I might be able to squeeze it in there and be able to do that. Make a video of Emily. Why do I keep saying Emily? By the way, Emily is gone. She is now with her new mommy. She made an opening video. And I don't remember the girl's YouTube. Shoot. Okay, well, I'll tell you what. When I make the um, video later, I will mention her name. And I'll put her in the descriptions. The description down below so that you can link you yeah, so you can link I am I am all kinds of just discombobulated I will put her link in the description below or her name whatever so you can go over and see um, the baby over there on her channel um, I kind of miss her I keep saying Emily obviously you've heard me do it at least once um, but that's okay. She's in a good place. Her um, new mommy loves her, which is awesome. So, yeah. Um, what was I saying? Oh, so I'm going to try to see if I can make a video of Brooke's surgery later. Our mail doesn't come until about 11 o'clock in the morning, so sometimes a little earlier. Yes, yeah, sweet girl over there and see everybody. Sorry guys, I'm trying not to put myself in the video, but it's kind of hard. I don't have a very long reach. I'm only five foot two, <laughs> so I'm kind of short and squatty. Oh boy, this is looking pretty cute on her. I got this from somebody on Instagram. I don't remember. I'm so terrible. I'm so sorry. If you're watching this and I got this outfit from you, thank you so much. I love it. Um, but I just don't remember because I ordered so many things from so many people. Um, I can't possibly remember 
where I got one item. So I apologize for that. Aren't my little babies so cute over there? Can you see them? They're twinning. I haven't changed them since I put them in these outfits. They're just too cute in these. Want to hear something terrible? Um, I have been contemplating selling Brody. Isn't that horrible? He's, um, come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Oh, yes. He is not getting any attention. He's laying in the bassinet. Um, but I can't sell him. Look at him. Every time I pick him up, I fall back in love with him again. And, um, he's just too realistic to hold and whatever. But I had actually contemplated selling him. I don't know, guys. Maybe if, if he still sits in the in the bassinet and doesn't get any kind of attention for the next couple of weeks, um, I might end up selling him. Because the way I explained it to my husband, and I talked to my husband about it, um, is I have Delaney, which is not going anywhere. Even if I don't do anything with Delaney, she's still not going anywhere. She's special. I love her. Um, here, little girl. She's staying here. Um, I buy her clothes, and I love to do it, okay? And then I have Brooke. So I have clothes left here from Emily for Brooke, and I've bought Brooke new things. And um, I've noticed that while I'm out shopping, I feel like, well, I have to buy Brody something. I've bought something for Delaney, and I've bought something for Brooke, so I have to get Brody something. And I don't want to feel like that. I don't want to feel like, oh, I have to buy this vinyl doll an outfit or he's going to be left out. Because the fact of the matter is, is just a doll. Um, he's not going to feel left out. He doesn't care. Um, so I don't want to have to feel like that. Uh, and he really, he has more clothes than, than these two. Um, but I just, I still feel that, well, I have to get Brody something. And I don't, I hate that feeling. <clears throat> I want it to be something I enjoy doing, not something I feel like I have to do. You know what I mean? And lately it's just been a, I feel like I have to. I don't like that. So, anyways, that's why I was contemplating selling him, because the joy of buying him things is is basically not gone, but... And I just think it's because of Brooke. She's the new baby... Um, I don't know. I just don't know. <laughs> you know, but then again, I, I still love to buy Delaney things, and she's not new. She's probably, she's my oldest baby. Have I had her longer? I've had her longer than Brody. I think. <clears throat> but, yeah. I'm rambling, sorry. But right now, I'm not selling this guy, Brody. But who knows, maybe in a couple of weeks I'll be like, okay, Brody's for sale. He's just sitting in the playpen. Not playpen, bassinet. And he's, you know, we'll see. But anyways, enough of my rambling. Here's the baby Delaney in her cloud outfit. See her, guys? I'll take you down so you can see her. Oof, you're stuck. There we go. And where is she? And there she is. Doesn't she look so sweet? She's so cute. Oh, I love her. I say that every time I change her, don't I? Every video she's in, I'm like, oh, I love her. I love her. Well, I do. She's just the cutest. And here's my littles. My little guys. Here's my princess. My little man. All right. Um... I just saw the UPS truck go by. I wonder if... I don't think Bountiful Baby is coming by UPS. I'm pretty sure it's USPS. So, how long is this video? Nine minutes. Sorry, sorry I got my face right up in there. Um, okay, well, it's long enough, right? I'm not going to do her hair. It looks perfectly fine. She looks so cute. Oh, yeah, I wanted to talk about something. Mercari, okay... It's that app where you can go on and buy stuff. 
from different people that are selling whatever. Um, so I went on there and I ordered from two different people, purple, two different people. I ordered her a bumbo seat um, and I ordered, hold on. That truck is coming back. Anyways, her a bumbo seat and I ordered Emily a um, outfit, two outfits that came with one hanger. Does that make sense? A set. There we go. It's early. <laughs> so her an outfit set and her a bumbo seat. And um, the outfits, the lady immediately um, labeled it as shipped. So I was like, oh, cool, that's going to come soon, whatever. Um, her bumbo seat, uh, I didn't hear from her for like four days. And then I went to cancel the order, and then she immediately sent me a message and said, hey, I'm out of town, I'll be home tomorrow, and I'll send your seat right out. You'll have it soon. I was like, oh, okay, thanks. I canceled the um, request to cancel the order. Um, so this all happened, I ordered them on the 14th. Um, so four days later, the 18th maybe, three days later, it was the 17th, um, no, it was the 18th, I'm right, her bumble seat thing, the lady was like, oh, I'll mail it tomorrow. So today is what, the 21st, 22nd, I don't know, but I haven't heard from either seller. Her outfits are still marked as pre-shipped, you know, the pre-shipping label, um, so I went and I canceled both orders. Yesterday I did this. And I still haven't heard anything from anybody. So I don't know if the money is being refunded. If the people are going to ship them out now. Um, if they've already been shipped and tracking isn't keeping up. I have no idea what's going on. So I'm pretty sure I'm going to be deleting this Mercari app off of my phone. And not using it anymore. It's a hassle. And... People aren't really held accountable for, you know, shipping and communication and all that kind of stuff. So, um, I'm kind of disappointed because I really wanted her to have a bumbo seat, but, um, I think, I guess this boppy is working out just fine. Maybe I don't really need one. Oh, well. So, have any of you guys had any issues with this Mercari app like this? And if so, what do you do? Do you just you know, hurry up and wait, and just wait, 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 or have you had good experiences with it, and I just happen to have two flops, um, let me know what your experiences have been with this, this app, um, because I'm pretty disappointed in it, I mean, I've heard good things about it from a friend of mine on Instagram, but <clears throat> I must have just hit two, two duds, it's typical, I usually have that kind of luck. <laughs> um, listen to my voice. I'm all groggy and weird sounding. Oh, brother. Look at, look at, say hi. Isn't she so cute? I love this little girl. She's so sweet. Um, I'm thinking about actually displaying her in the living room. I have a bookshelf. I would put her up on the top of the bookshelf, um, in this boppy seat and just have her out in the living room so everybody can see her. My kids love her. She's like, she's the favorite. Just don't tell those two. She's my favorite too. She's so sweet, so cute. Anyways, I'm rambling still. Okay, I will try to make a video later of... <sighs> Sorry. Oh my gosh, I'm so tired. Of Brooke's surgery. Um, and see if we can... Uh, get her taken care of and I want to show you those those beads that are in her in her limbs they're really I don't like them I mean they make her squishy but they make her really light like an actual doll you would buy from Walmart and I really you know I don't want that I want her to feel realistic and nice and heavy <coughs> all right anyway um I will talk to you guys later thanks for watching and thanks for listening to me ramble bye